The Food and Drug Administration is warning consumers against the use of several hand sanitizer brands because a harmful chemical was found in them. Channel 3's Joy Duke spoke to a UTC biology professor who explains the risk and a local distillery owner who takes us inside the facility where he is making hand sanitizer. Joy, tell us about it. Well, Cindy, that harmful chemical is methanol. It's a byproduct of certain types of alcohol, and it was recently discovered in nine brands of hand sanitizer uh, manufactured in Mexico by Esk Biochem. It's a product millions have been leaning on through the coronavirus pandemic. Don't forget that hand sanitizing is a very important way to uh, limit your potential exposure to the uh, COVID virus including local distillery owners who've had to change their business strategy due to the pandemic. We've made about 8,000 gallons of hand sanitizer so far. The FDA has reported finding dangerous levels of methanol in nine hand sanitizer brands manufactured in Mexico. All clean hand sanitizer, clean care, no germ hand sanitizer, and seven other products were listed. Normally, uh, FDA requires a very pure grade of ethanol to be used. Methanol is a chemical both the FDA and UTC biology professor Dr. Henry Spratt say can cause severe illness if used on hands and can be deadly to ingest. You can also have some negative effects by inhaling the vapor and it can be absorbed through the skin. And so, hence, that is going to tie into the concerns for using methanol in a hand sanitizer. The FDA hasn't said whether any of these products were sold in the U.S. Gate 11 distillery owner Bill Lee says it's not an ingredient you find in the hand sanitizer his business has been producing locally since March. So we're using the World Health Organization Formula One. This is sanctioned by the FDA. Gate 11 ingredients include alcohol, water, glycerin, and hydrogen peroxide. We're supplying uh, EPB, TVA, City of Chattanooga, Hamilton County First Responders, VW. Lee wants Chattanooga residents to know they can still rely on locally manufactured alternatives as the pandemic continues. So I just uh, wanted people in the community to know that there is quality alcohol, uh, hand sanitizer being made right here in Chattanooga. I'm told by an FDA spokesperson that there is no safe level of methanol that should be present in any hand sanitizer. For a full list of the uh, brands that the FDA has flagged as potentially harmful, you can click on this story inside the WRCB app. And if you're interested in purchasing a hand sanitizer from Gate 11, you can also find that information inside this story. For now, live at home, Joy Dukes, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.